Hello, hello everyone, Lego4366 here today. Today I'm reviewing um, Lego Star Wars, The Mandalorian, uh, Trouble on Tatooine. It has 276 pieces and it's like $24.99 on rollback at Walmart or $24.99 and $29.99 for a regular price. And it has about, it has three numbered bags and two smaller bags and one cape box. And it has two minifigures, Mandalorian and the Tusken Raider. And of course, Grogu himself. So, yes. No, no stickers, just one instruction booklet. So here it is. Here's all the pieces it comes with. There you go. Alright. Here's the box. The Mandalorian, the child Tusken Raider. Very nice, very nice set, easy to build, fun to build, very cool. So you can see all of that. There you go. There's a lot of action in this set, so that's pretty cool. It's a good thing to get for ages 7 and up, so it's a good thing to get for a kid or for a collector alike. It's a good thing to display, and it's got a lot of playability, so yeah, it's pretty nice. Very good representation of the show. Okay, so here you have Maybe if we get right here, the Tuscan Raider. He's got his Bantha stick. There you go. And here you have the child, Baby Yoda. There you go. And here is the Mandalorian with his full suit of armor. There you go. So what the back looks like. Very nice. And you have that. And he's got his. Um, his guns and his rifle and his gun here and then you have his speeder which is very nice very well built very fun build so yep you have that and he's got his little backpack right there and then he's got his little baby like baby carrying thingy so yep we've got that so let's see what he looks like when he has that on his baby pouch on Oopsies. So yeah, you just lift that up, and no, where'd it go? You lift that up, and just put that there, and you take this, and put it on, and put his head back on. And there you go, and we put the baby inside. There you go, look how cute he looks. Very nice, very cool. His little pouch, very cool. He's got his little thing right there. And you can also take it off and put it here so you can ride on it just like in the show, like that. And you've got this. And put that back on. Okay, so I'm going to have him ride on the speeder bike now. Okay, so you put him in the speeder bike. And you can just... Isn't that arm printing great? That's very nice, very cool. Has his little gauntlets on there. Okay, so you have that. He's got that. So yeah, you can move this. You can move this up and down. Got that, very nice. You can put this on here so you can put his guns his gun on there. You see that? You put the other one here. You got that. So there you go. And these are all the extra pieces it comes with. So yeah, you have an extra projectile and you have all of these pieces, an extra gun and whatnot. Very nice. So you can make an extra rifle if you wanted. But we're not going to do that right now. 
And here is their little um, Tuscan Raider hut. So that's pretty nice. Very cool. This is very nice. You can. So yeah, it looks like that. And then he's got his little pot that he's making, and a little stove it looks like, and a bone. And he's got that. Here's his the little top. And he's got, and then the fireplace. So yeah, if you want to like, you can even fold it up and like put it in the background so then it can be the little hut in the background. So that's cool. Pretty nice. And you can take the fireplace in and out so it's like they can put the fireplace out. And uh, you can know, have the pot over here. Whatever you want to do. So yeah, it's pretty cool. So yeah, here they can be sitting on the fire. I mean, not on the fire, but by the fire. There you go, so you have that. He's got his little... So there you go. Very nice. And then here you have your little... Um, bow cast. And so this is a fun... This is a fun build. So you have this part. And then you can move... Oops, I just shot it. Did you all see that? And then you can move this up and down. Move these pieces. This part's a little bit fragile. Which is frustrating, but that's okay. And so yeah, it's, a, it's very accurate, very cool, very nice. You can move this up and down. And we can put in another projectile and launch it. It's very good. I don't know if they've like improved on the springs or the projectiles or not, but it feels very, um, I don't know, it just feels a lot more natural when you shoot it. So yeah, I'm going to shoot it. There you go. There we go, it's pretty cool, it comes with a lot of cool pieces, it's very nice, this is one of my favorite episodes, so I think it's nice that we have this, and I like the set, it's very cool, if you're a Ma Mandalorian fan, this is a must-have, I feel like, and so yeah, you should pick up this set, it's a great set, and for $24.99, it's not a bad price, so yeah, I recommend you get it, it's a fun set, a lot of playability, it's very nice. You can even um, buy two and start having multiple, and you can add to the huts and make mocks and whatnot. So that's very cool. So, yeah. Very nice. Got a very nice Mandalorian figure. So, yeah, I don't think it's exclusive to this set as I think he comes in the same one with the um, armor figure with the um, armory. So. Is that what it's called? The Armory of Root? Yeah, I think so. That's the newest Mandalorian set anyway, that's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, so yeah, you get these cool pieces right here. Very fun build, very nice. So yeah, it's good for mocks and photography and just cl collectability and stuff and just fun to display and play with. I recommend you get it. So yeah, thanks for watching guys and have a great day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.